Before we get in the video, please like, make sure to subscribe, turn on your notifications, go ahead and leave a comment below. And click on the how you can help, which brings up the Family for the Game website and gives you lots of ideas how you can help us. Thank you. Hey everybody, Paul Burry, Family from the Gaming, and I am doing a sponsor video for Bright Paw. Playing this on Steam, so a personal computer, a PC. Rogue. Best played with headphones. It's got auto saving and a nice little cat loading. Look at that. Just cats walking along. Isn't that music? That music is just like soothing, relaxing. All right, let's start it. X zero level one shelter. Oh, there you are, Theo. Oh, honestly, there you are, Theo. Your own dream. Honestly, <laughs> your own dream. <laughs> Do you even know where you are? Oh well, it's time we got you sorted oh, well, out with these cards. It's time we got you sorted Good. out with these cards. Come on, cards. Cards. Day. Come on I like now. cards. We haven't got all day. Tap and hold a card to preview. Just give that rewind button a tap, and we'll see if we can't start walking around. Rewind! I like rewinding. Oh, there you are, Theo. Oh, honestly. There you are, Theo. Your own dream. Honestly. Do you even know where you are? Oh, well. It's time we got you sorted out for these cards. Oh, that wasn't the rewind. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Just give that rewind button a tap, and we'll see if we can't start walking around things instead of into them. If you ever find yourself in a pickle, just remember that you can take a step back and try something else. I like rewinds. Give these a whirl and see where they get you. Ooh, I like this. Oh, nice. Any time. What's that just there? What's Maybe that you just there? Peak. Maybe you should give it a peek. What am I looking at? This? Oh, it's an odd cat box. A strangely familiar but otherwise nondescript box washed up on the shores of Theo's subconscious. Vice. Hmm. I wonder what that's hmm. doing sitting around here. I wonder what that's doing Maybe sitting around here. Maybe you should keep your eyes open for other interesting things. You never Box. know what you'll find. Well, we're done here. Go on, well, we're done here. Go on, leap into your family's arms. Lauren, and Nathaniel, arms. Are Lauren and Nathaniel are waiting. Hi, family. <gasps> Act one. Murder. Oh, no. That sounds bad. Very, very bad. We're going to wake up. So I guess the entire game is not a dream. Cat's like, I'm just trying to sleep here. What was that? Okay. After being woken unceremoniously by, by a sudden Theo noise, that our hero Theo awake. felt that if he was to be kept to awake, he deserved to Good know. thought. Bump, bump, bump. We made it to the green square. Act 1, level 2, Disturbance. Oh, it's a grand piano. All right, so we want to go. Boom. 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 The 
this is pretty cool. Hastily packed suitcase. Oh. Oh, the family. Family photo despite awkward posing and happiness and pride are visible in this photo. It's certainly starting to look that way. Act 1, level 3, bodies. The what kitchen the... Seemed normal. Uh oh The kitchen seemed Excuse normal. Me. What was that? He could see Excuse across me. the room. What was that? He could see he across the room. Look. He had to take a closer look. Bodies 1 of 3. Who? 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 Act one, level four. Lights. Hopefully, it's not Yagami. Cautiously examining the hallway, Fear saw no signs of the killer. Instead, he found a path of destruction carved through strange machines before him. Uh, Nathaniel's graduation offers a youth of oblivious to the crushing disappointment of reality after formal education. Light 2, out of place robot. Grandfather clock. Like all household clocks, the rhythm ticking. It's a constant reminder of the universe's slow march to enter. Yeah. 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 The deeper into the room, fear moved, the more he realized that something was a mess. That bright red light had an I love this narrator. This narrator is awesome. Act 2. Chase. Hopefully we don't run across someone like Light Yagami or something like that. That would be really bad. Act 2, 1. Lasers. Uh-oh. Although he could not shake the image of his departed owners, he suddenly found himself somewhere very jump. different indeed. However, before he could appreciate his new surroundings, he found his attention drawn to the glowing hot wall of energy in front of him. Uh, let's see here. One, two... Faced with something so clearly hazardous, so he, so he, he thought it might be wise to take a moment to think before, before diving headlong into oblivion. Should we do this oh, one? What a pleasant surprise! Oh, what a After pleasant his surprise! Maneuver, After his daring maneuver, Theo found that he was still Clearly, alive. Clearly, Theo didn't, didn't have time to mess about with the killer on the loose. Perhaps that vent opted a way forwards. Oh, lasers. Grabbed it too late, sorry. Act 2, level 2, janitor. Ruined security bot. Still somewhat trial. tense from his Fear previous was trial. Fear was immensely relieved to find, no, no, deadly relieved to find no deadly lasers when he emerged from the hand, vent. He On the other hand, he was instead faced with a functional, frantic, frantic security and quite <laughs> security robot. <laughs> a modern, threatening-looking robot rendered immobile and useless. Janitorial bot. A poor custodian spinning its wheels, attempting to clean up after someone else. Theo found himself eyeing the hole of the quarry. Either someone was stalking the halls, shooting at water features, or the security needed to work on their aim. Though the appeal of fresh fish was enticing, it was offset by the risk of an unexpected god. Rather than contemplate such a terrible fate any further, Theo decided to make a quick exit. Ooh, I can shake it. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Come on. Moving on. No more fishy for me. 
Act two, level three, stealth. Oh. Advancing cautiously. Advancing cautiously. Fear was encouraged by the sight of another aquarium. This time with the water safely inside, not threatening to unpleasantly dampen his perch. There was no time to fish, however, as security appeared to be taking its job a touch more seriously. <laughs> of course it does. Stealth, the golden cat statue. Is it starfish? Ah, Starfish alive, not sure, dead, maybe unfazed by the current situation, definitely. Okay, what else is glowing? Although Theo could be easily distracted, he knew when it was time to focus. Hmm. That time had arrived. That time had arrived. No, it doesn't like that one. That time had arrived. That time had arrived. Yes, yes, yes. So tearing his attention away from uh -oh. tearing his attention away from the unattainable, Phil delicately stepped between the broken remains of some very expensive looking showpieces. Despite his lack of any understanding of fine art, he was disgusted by the wanton destruction before him. Having successfully weaved past the having successfully weaved past the searching eyes of the guard, he was just overjoyed to see that he could just follow the killer through a door. Instead of crawling through the ventilation like a rodent. Oh, there's another. That, that other painting was what else I could uh, mess with. Theo cast his eyes about the grandiose, Theo cast his eyes about oh, the grandiose room. The, the impressive decor marred by the smoking wreckage of robotic guards. Clearly, someone with no respect, Clearly, for, interior with no respect for interior design had been this way. <laughs> Hanging over the remains of a reception <laughs> desk, Theo spotted something that took his interest. Industries. Bright poor industries. A vending machine. Reception bots. Although this place Theo was knew impressive, he had, Theo knew he had precious little time to admire it. Despite the damage, the underlying Despite cast, the damage, of, this the underlying cast of this bright poor establishment was clear. The placement of several large aquariums, brimming with exotic fish, was an inspired design choice that Theo could respect. Oh, there we go. The bright boss sign. Okay, so... Theo crossed the room, breathing in the intoxicating fragrance of fish, while taking care to avoid the remaining hazards. As he did, his mind began to wander. Why was a place like this situated beneath his home? Good question. More importantly, why had these fishy treats not been brought to attention before? Yeah. Theo likes fish. Act 2, level 5, show floor. Why can't he... At first glance, it appeared that Theo had stumbled, glance, into, a that Theo had stumbled into a storage room for Except broken glass. There were other Except items the there were fragments. other items in the glittering Grenades. fragments. Missiles? Grenades? An umbrella? Missiles? An umbrella? Classic bomb. When it comes down to it, some of bag, I just want the classics. A patrol bot. It's been accidentally run over. There we go, show floor. Trick umbrella advertisement. Theo 
Geo padded behind the gun, pondering his discoveries. A hidden underground facility, robotic security, and now rooms filled with odd weapons. What on earth was this place? Okay, I did something wrong here. Oh, I just reset it. Don't. Oh, my mistake. At first glance, it appeared. At first glance, yeah. it appeared. Theo padded behind the gun. Pondering his discoveries. A hidden underground facility, robotic security, and now rooms filled with odd weapons. What on earth was this place? There we go. Looking back, Theo considered that it was perhaps unwise to leave such destructive toys lying around. On the other hand, and there was no way someone would leave live explosives on display. Explosives on display. Hmm. Yes, yeah, so let's hurry on. Hurry on. Act two, level six, the boardroom. This is a this is a pretty cool puzzle. It's getting more and more difficult every level. Contemplated the ruins of the once magnificent boardrooms, which had been reduced to little more than burnt mahogany by some kind of explosion. Apparently, the killer had needed to clear the room in a hurry. But why? Oh, perhaps those lasers were a motivation. Perhaps those lasers were a motivation. They motivate me. Boardroom a grenade advertisement. Did you need to disappear in a hurry? Would you prefer them in pieces? Then they're definitely for you. Caution. Good throwing arm not included. Nathaniel Steelings. What Nathaniel might falsely consider this first real successful life. Sealed by, sealed by handshake and immortalized imprint. Okay, where's the other one? Aha! A trapped chair, and his chair is designed to help establish the dominance and meaning by disposing of undesirable attendees. Hmm. Alright, so... We wanna go... With the wall of death slowly advancing, With the wall of death slowly advancing, we are scrambled for a plan to slip by. Across the room, a shattered glass wall offering a glimpse of escape. Ah. Steadily avoiding glass. Ah. We have found his eyes drawn to a large portrait on the wall. Was that Nathaniel? As he stood, he wondered. As he stood, He's not standing. How much of all this was his master responsible for? All right. Let's start that one over. Mistakes were made. Now we gotta click on all Theo these. Contemplated the ruins Theo of the contemplated the ruins of the once magnificent boardroom, which had been reduced to little more than burnt mahogany by, by some kind of explosion. Apparently, the killer had needed to clear the room in a hurry. But why? Oh, oh. Perhaps, those were a Perhaps those lasers were a motivator. Yes. I wish they would keep what you, your collectibles you find. That would be nice. With the wall of death slowly advancing, with the wall of death slowly advancing, we are scrambled for a plan to slip by. There, across the room, a shattered glass wall offering a glimpse of escape. Deftly avoiding glass with his paws. Deftly avoiding glass with his paws. found his eyes drawn to a large portrait on the wall. Nathaniel. Yes, it was. As he stood, he wondered. How much of all this was his master responsible for? I don't know. Act three, motive. I never really thought of making a game like this, but this is a pretty good idea for a game. Someone had clearly been rifling through, Someone the, had deliveries clearly been rifling through the deliveries they recently, they though they for. didn't seem to have found what they were looking for. So box of empty vials. Box torn up and abandoned, leaving the vials within untouched. What could these be for? Ransack crates, a collection of crates turned over for desperate search. And paper over here. Patrol bot blueprint. Technical specification for a bright pause industry security robot. Surprisingly simple. Obvious 
Obviously, the killer had been looting Obviously, the facility, the been looting the facility. They and it was unlikely that they planned to use volatile weaponry to <laughs> How do you know, man? to put a stop to the killer's nefarious activities. Aww. Act 3, level 2, Depot. Oh, this looks weird. Finding himself inside a warehouse, the town's stacks of crates gave Theo some measure of hope. Perhaps the killer would try to search the top of an unstable tile and fall to their doom. Hefty weapons case. Sadly, none of these weapons of destruction appear to be built with pause in mind. The world can be a very unfair place. Oh, poor kitty cat. Sea mine crate. Something built to sink ships but have no trouble with an overconfident cat. Not for prodding. Lost in daydreams of the killer being buried alive, Fear stepped blindly forwards onto a conveyor belt, promptly shuffling him away from his happy thoughts. Uh oh. Perhaps you should pay more attention to where he's going. Perhaps. Oh, you gave me two spots. That's kind of cool. I could have been in the one. I would say so. Conveyor belts is a new uh, twist in this game. Theft. Spotting a bond under some nearby crates, it appeared Theo's wishes had been heard. However, he tempered his excitement until he could get a closer look. Looted explosives crate. Tipped over crate that should be filled with explosives, but worryingly empty. Completely average box. Oh, an empty crate. Very interesting. Close to the definition of scrapping the bottom of the barrel. to conclude the three things. The killer had found what they were looking for. They were, looking for. They were definitely up Theo's to something. The Fear's work was not yet he done. He moved on with the hope that the killer's loot would be enough to slow them down. Uh, does the killer have to do this as well? Take cover, Act 3, Level 4. Oh no. Theo pondered the erratic crusade of the robots as they fired at non-existent threats. Perhaps the killer had just passed through? Laser bot. Something simply wonderful about lasers. Efficient, destructive, and deadly. You know where you are with lasers. Algae container. Specifically designed crate used to safely house Omnigus algae. Push things, maybe. Door is I'll try this one. No, I can't do that.
felt unable to tell the difference between the cat and the crate, and lacking the desire to learn. I love that lacking the desire to learn. Oh, there's the last one. Take cover. Oh well. Mysterious drawing drawing lines carefully etched in the concrete that vaguely resemble a cat. The termination of the artist ex excuses their lack of detail to detail. The lack of attention to detail. Sorry. It was probably harmless. It was probably harmless. And we left one too. How cool is that? Act three, level five, scribbles. Theo was following had certainly spooked these poor robots who were all consumed by blind panic. Scribbles, a big algae container. The crate was developed to hold large amounts of glowing algae, also functions as well as mood lighting. See nothing else glowing. into the wall. Why would a killer stop to do Why would a killer stop to doodle? Hmm, is this gonna work? No, 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 I'm gonna get fried. No, 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 no. Okay, that's not gonna work. That doesn't work either. None of those work right. Hmm. What am I doing wrong here? Herbathio was following had certainly spooked these poor robots who were all consumed by blind panic. not the way to go. Don't have a weight either. Oh, 
So that don't work. That doesn't work. This doesn't work because nothing will let me go. So I gotta go one. Okay. Few can stop thinking about the bizarre graffiti it against the scene. It is unlikely the killer was taking the time for artistic was creativity. Someone else, was someone else in the facility? Oh, I see what we're gonna do here. So I didn't need to use that one earlier on. That makes sense. Now to think about it. Act three, level six, vandalism. As he stepped into the room, as he stepped into the room, fear found his bracing mind haunted by yet another drawing of a slightly more significant scale. A gun rack, a rack of very lethal and very legal firearms, a bestseller. Theo tried his best to examine the etching, but found it devoid of artistic value. Abstract mural. A for effort, he suppose. Okay, so they're moving to the right. He stepped into the room. Fear found his bracing mind haunted by yet another drawing of a slightly more significant scale. There's the mural again. There's the gun rack again. What was the Theo final? Tried his best to the Theo tried his best to examine the etching, but found it devoid of artistic value. I don't know what else I was supposed to find. I'm just gonna wait first. A for effort, he suppose. No. As he began to move away, Theo couldn't, he began to move away. Theo couldn't help but want to put so much effort into these acts of vandalism. Maybe some kind of. Maybe some kind of. Poorly drawn corn cup. Either. That's a bad idea. Okay. No! 
off whatever it was. The whatever it was, the mural failed to hold Fear's interest long enough for any meaning to be gleaned. I'm having trouble with this level. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and stop this video here. As this has been a sponsored video through uh, Catapult Indie Boost. I would like to thank everyone for watching and hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye!